Bitcoin versus altcoins. Understand what are the differences between Bitcoin and altcoins. When Bitcoin was launched in 2009, there was little to no competition in the new digital currency space. In 2011, however, the new types of cryptocurrencies began to emerge. Thus, the race to create more crypto was on. Today, there are thousands of different types of cryptocurrencies called altcoins, and while each one is designed to offer a new feature, most are based on similar principles to Bitcoin. But then, what are these altcoins, and how do they differ from Bitcoin? In this video, we will show you the difference between Bitcoin and these altcoins, and in general case, then we will explain case by case the nine best Bitcoin alternatives. So keep watching until the end. Let's dive right in. Altcoins are based on the same principle as Bitcoin, but go even further with unique features. Today, there are more than 15,430 different cryptocurrencies, with a total market capitalization of more than $2,700 billion. There are more than 15,430 altcoins circulating in the cryptocurrency markets. You may be wondering if we need them. But the truth is that it's just competition in a free market. The rapid popularity of cryptocurrencies has led to the creation of thousands of them. While they provide investors with options, they also make them nervous. Given the relatively new nature of the industry, it is wise to be able to distinguish between them. Thus, there are two categories, Bitcoin and altcoins. Given its dominant appeal, Bitcoin is the largest cryptocurrency. As the blockchain technology which cryptocurrency is based on has matured, it has led to the emergence of several new cryptocurrencies like Ethereum, Ripple and many others. These new coins have been dubbed altcoins, an abbreviation for alternative coins. These altcoins are based on the same principle as Bitcoin, but go even further with unique additions and features. Most altcoins have been launched to improve on Bitcoin in some way. Like Bitcoin, some cryptocurrencies have a limited supply of coins, which helps create demand and boost their perceived value. For example, there is a fixed number of Bitcoins that can be created, and that number is 21 million coins, as decided by the creator of Bitcoin. While most altcoins are built on the same basic framework as Bitcoin and share some of its features, each offers investors something different. Some altcoins use a different process to produce and validate transaction blocks. Others may offer new features, such as smart contracts or advantages such as low price volatility. You may be surprised to learn that the first altcoin to enter the market alongside Bitcoin was intended to decentralize the regulation of domain names on the web and was also used as an alternative digital currency. Generally speaking, altcoins have been built on the success of Bitcoin by slightly modifying the rules to appeal to specific users. For example, Ethereum, the second largest cryptocurrency by market capitalization, introduced the idea of smart contracts. These smart contracts are essentially code that executes only when predetermined conditions are met. They execute agreements between two parties using blockchain technology, opening up possibilities for developing new applications for cryptos. Altcoins have improved functionality, transactions and scaling to meet the booming demand. As the altcoin market continues to grow, many wonder if the leaders of the original cryptocurrency will end up with one of the successor coins. Simply put, Bitcoin is the original cryptocurrency, and all the others are altcoins. You may wonder if we need them, but the truth is that it's simply competition in the free market. Everyone is free to launch their cryptocurrency, and everyone who does so thinks, or at least claims, to have something unique to offer. But in practice, most of them are cryptocurrencies or reward tokens for certain apps and platforms. Despite their large numbers, only the strongest will survive to achieve mass adoption. However, is the growing competition from altcoins hurting Bitcoin? Well, be aware that in most cases, it only advances the crypto space. Furthermore, not all altcoins are direct copies of Bitcoin and often include unique value propositions. Known or not, recent or not, cryptocurrencies are assets in their own right. Nevertheless, the layman will often have trouble finding his way around. Between a technical lexical field, a speculative aspect difficult to master, 
but also various opportunities sold by the promoters of these altcoins, one will often spend hours analysing the market. Now it's time for us to go into more depth by taking case by case. To do this, we have compiled a list of nine altcoins to present. The first is none other than Litecoin. Just like Bitcoin, Litecoin is a digital currency with one purpose, decentralised digital payments. Created in 2011 to address the perceived shortcomings of Bitcoin, it offers faster transactions, lower fees and a larger pool of tokens. A simpler term then, we can say that Bitcoin is digital gold and Litecoin is a digital currency. The second is Ethereum, ETH. For those who don't know, Ethereum is a more advanced second generation decentralized digital currency. It is used to run smart contracts, decentralized applications, dApps, and is also the most popular digital currency for funding ICOs. Like other cryptocurrencies, ETH is also widely accepted as a means of payment. The third is EOS, which is another second generation blockchain and semi decentralized digital currency designed to power dApps and DAOs. It is competing with Ethereum for the title of the world's best smart contract platform. EOS is faster and more scalable than Ethereum, but it sacrifices decentralization for this functionality. For this reason, EOS is governed by a proof of participation, DPoS consensus, and uses the EOS constitution to define the rules of the platform. In addition, EOS is much younger than Ethereum and is not yet widely accepted. The fourth is Bitcoin Cash, BCH. Like Litecoin, Bitcoin Cash is a fork of Bitcoin born in the summer of 2017. Its founders referred to it as real Bitcoin. Ultimately, BCH addresses Bitcoin's slow transactions, high energy consumption and royalty issues, but it has so far failed to gain community recognition. Like Bitcoin, it is a digital payment currency. The fifth is Ripple, XRP, which is another digital token for payments. In addition, Ripple Labs also use it as a source of liquidity for real-time cross-border fiduciary payments. For this reason, it is often referred to as a bank token. This coin is designed to be the fastest and most scalable digital asset. The sixth is Tether, USDT, which is the most popular stable digital asset in the space. It is a stable currency linked to the US dollar with a one-to-one -one ratio. This means that one Tether is always worth one USD and can be exchanged for a transfer at any time. It essentially combines the benefits of blockchain technology with the stability of fiat currencies, reducing volatility in otherwise extremely volatile markets. Traders often use it to hedge their funds in times of uncertainty. In addition, it can be used as a means of payments as it can be sent anywhere in the world via the blockchain. Nevertheless, unlike Bitcoin or Ethereum, Tether is highly centralised and its transactions can be stopped at any time by Tether Company Limited. The seventh is Tron, TRX. Tron is a semi-centralised digital currency for digital entertainment and content generation systems. The Tron protocol provides scalability, high availability and high-speed communicating HTC support for building decentralised applications in the Tron ecosystem. In addition, it is comparable with Ethereum smart contracts. The main objective of the network is to decentralise webcasting. The TRX coin is used to share content on the network and reward content creators who contribute to the network. Therefore, it can be classified as both a digital currency and a utility token. The eighth on our list is Monero, XMR. It is a decentralized cryptocurrency focused on privacy and designed to make anonymous payments. It is one of the longest running currencies on the market since its launch in 2014. Every MXR user can control their level of visibility and personal data. Moreover, it is much faster and more scalable than Bitcoin. Despite this, the coin's privacy features are not always put to good use, as indicated by the increasing popularity on the dark web and other nefarious incidents. Finally, the ninth is Cardano, still called ADA. 
Cardano is the native token of the Cardano platform. It is designed to be a third generation cryptocurrency capable of powering smart contracts, network applications, side chains, metadata, and distributed multi party computation. While still in development, the project aims to be a new, more powerful, faster, more scalable, and more energy efficient Bitcoin with uncompromising security. As mentioned in the examples above, the most popular cryptocurrencies differ in their ideas and use cases. While some of them have more specialized niches than others, they mostly seek to gain an advantage over Bitcoin by trading on certain technological aspects, as in the case of the metaverse cryptocurrencies, which have brought something new to the table and for some present huge earning potential. Want to know more about this? We've compiled a list of the seven best metaverse blockchains and cryptos. We invite you to watch this video next.